Hey guys, RNC Music here, and today we have a little bit of a different video. Um, I'm here to talk to you about this app. Um, yeah, it's not sponsored at all, but we're just going to talk a little bit about uh, music streaming apps. So, I can guarantee you, I, without a doubt, that most of you watching this video use Spotify to stream your music, whether that's the free or, or you have a premium account. Um, now me, personally, I do not use Spotify because I think that their practices are evil. And personally, I just don't like Spotify. The, it's MP3 quality audio and I'm an audio, audiophile. Um, so, yeah. But I do use an app called Deezer. Now, Deezer is kind of like the Odyssey uh, music streaming services. Kind of underground, a little against the grain. It doesn't have everything yet, but it has most of the big stuff, and it supports um, FLAC file streaming. So FLACs, what they are is the FLAC format is the free lossless audio codec. So basically what it is, is the closest sounding digital audio format to a CD. Um, MP3s are compressed, and there's other formats like AAC, which are also lossless, but FLAC is the best and most widely supported. And so that's why I like Deezer, is you can stream a FLAC file on your 4G mobile network. I know that's super inefficient and it eats through your data like no tomorrow, but it's cool that you can do it. Now, like Spotify, Deezer has a pay structure. Um, there's a premium tier and a free tier. And honestly, Deezer's getting a little big nowadays. And I don't like giving my money to big companies like that sometimes, especially the evil music ones. So that's why I'm here to talk to you guys about an app called Freezer. So like YouTube Vanced, Freezer is a client for Deezer, yet it has removed all the ads and it has unlocked the flax streaming quality for your free account. Now, I have a free account um, for Deezer. I have not paid for Deezer Premium, but I am allowed to stream the premium content because I have Freezer. Um, now, Freezer is a play on the word Deezer and free, just like YouTube Vanced is a play on the word advanced without the ad. So, um, basically what this does is it's just a separate client for Deezer, removing the paywall and the ads which is super nice. It does have a client for Android, Windows, and Linux. Um, I'm gonna show you the Windows client, the Android client, um, well, some of it because I'll have to record from the camera on the S7. But I will just show you a little bit of that, and then um, it also has a Linux client, but I don't daily drive Linux, so um, sorry about that, I guess. Uh, so yeah, so let's let's check out the Windows client. Welcome to Windows. So um, I will show you the Freezer client for uh, Microsoft Windows. So as you can see here, it has a cool little uh, refrigerator with the uh, Deezer um, gradient on it. So if we just open it up here, and as you'll notice, the name is Freezer Portable. Um, it is a portable install, so it's installed into itself, and it's basically just its own app. You can move it from a USB drive to a um, SD card to your built-in um, storage on your laptop, like literally anything. So that's really cool for one. Um, so here is the client for Freezer. So as you'll notice, we have a little uh, pop-up um, sidebar and it has all your things so you can have your account right here that's my account um, your home which just has basically popular stuff I don't go into the home too much because I don't obviously listen to popular music but you know there's some playlists that I like and some of the freeze the Deezer made um, soundtrack uh, soundtracks playlists and then if you go to browse you can have like literally all the genres you could ever want um, so podcast charts and then you know, like all the music genres, categories, podcasts, Deezer has podcasts, um, and then library, which is blocked off, but that's because I haven't imported any files to play in Freezer. So if we go to tracks, this is your individual track search. So if I just type in here, 
us and them it'll pull up for me um, give it a second to load it will pull up me all of the tracks on Deezer called us and them and then it's the same thing with playlists you type in the name of a playlist albums artists and then more is blocked off uh, settings so here's the interesting bit so streaming quality mp3 at 128 kilobits per second mp3 at 320 kilobits per second or you can choose to stream a flac file at 1444 kilobits a second which is really high quality um, I have my downloads directory set to an SD card so if I wanted to download songs off here you can and you and I think I have it set yes for the um, download quality to download FLAC files from freezer and then you can do simultaneous downloads I have it set to 4 for band bandwidth limitations on my home Wi-Fi um, you, you can download art cover the album cover so when you play it on something like VLC it'll show that um, you can download the lyrics too which is really cool and then you create folders for artists um, create folders for playlists like this is super intuitive really really cool stuff um, crossfade uh, that's on here which is really nice um, and then you can, there's the download name for all that stuff um, you can change the colors um, keeping the sidebar open and there's integrations which is really nice um, uh, and then just a bunch of like lockout stuff and here's your downloads folder within freezer you can also access this in something like a file manager uh, but that's just downloads I have not downloaded anything um, importer so you can um, import songs from Spotify which is really nice and play them through freezer which is super cool I obviously won't use it because I don't really care for Spotify all that much and if we go to about we'll see this is freezer version 1.1.17 there's the website they have a, a couple telegram groups discord uh, server and then credits down here which is really awesome now there I, I have a disclaimer um, there are no clients currently for any Apple products so there's no iPad OS no iOS or um, Mac OS ports for this x86 or um, the new uh, M1 and I don't suggest you visit the website on any Apple products because uh, it leads to let's just say some adult content um, a pretty sick prank um, I obviously don't condone it or think it's funny but you know and people on the internet will have their fun so that's that and last bit of the video is gonna be me talking about um, what my thoughts will be on freezer so I've only had it for a couple of days now and I think it's really good audio file quality almost in par on par with title um, which I think is really good that there's an alternative for audio file streaming other than title um, now I have for the past I want to say year so right right before the pandemic um, and all this stuff went down I have been basically delegated to Spotify for my music streaming just out of convenience and the ability to use Spotify plus plus yes I admit it I have a cracked version of Spotify on my phone um, but I, I've used that for basically uh, the better well worst part of a year um, and I just have been really not pleased with the quality and sound of Spotify and honestly just not pleased with their business practices in general um, and I absolutely hate the Spotify Windows client so that's that um, so now I have a client for Windows for freezer which is really nice so what I am going to do is for this week since it is summer now um, I am going to daily drive freezer for about a week and I will make a follow-up video to this to this one and relay to you guys my thoughts whether you should um, venture into trying it out for yourself even if you already use Spotify and you're not interested in the audiophile flat capabilities of this um, app uh, it doesn't have ads on it so you know 
uh, if that is one of the pros and that's big and outweighs the cons of the app, maybe you should try it out and switch to uh, Freezer. Um, yeah. And I'm like, what, what's the worst they can do? Terminate your account? Make a new one. You know? Boo-hoo. They can't arrest you. It's not illegal what we're doing. Um, so, yeah. That's really all I have had have to say on Freezer right now. I can show you the Android client real quick. I said I would, but I do have to do it off the camera. So as you can see, same gradient. Sorry for the low quality. I'm using my webcam. And then it just kind of, it's a little bit of a basic um, UI. Um, it's, a, it's a lot more toned down than the uh, Windows client. It doesn't have the whole sidebar thing. But, man, there you go. That's about that. Um, so, yeah. That's been my little talk on Freezer. Um, I will have a follow-up video on Freezer after the week is over, um, and I'll relay my thoughts. Um, this has been RNC Music, and for the time being, have a wonderful start to your summer, and I am out.